Well, there's money in here, at least, I guess. Anything that mates for life, I always just... I guess it upsets me. Uh, rules to expand. He has trained his strategic brilliance on a singular ver er, vision. To conquer the world, though he rightly calls this not conquest but salvation. Yes, the Emperor of Nilfgaard sets the world alight with the torch of civilization. Trampling the still warm corpses of his father's usurp usurpers. The Emperor seized the throne and began to assimilate the Northern Realms, one after the other. Terror engulfed the North. Nor the North. Terror engulfed the North! Sorry. <laughs> God damn it. Terror engulfed the North. Only the Battle of Brenna? Slow the Imperial Army's march towards victory. A temporary peace then took hold, though none believed this mirage would last. M here's aim. To make the entire north a vassal of Nilfgaard remain unchanged. I'm here used peace as a cover to intensify his political efforts. Now, all can see their results. Chaos and disorder devour the Nordling's estates. Ridden with internal bickering and backstabbing, they near collapse. Only a strong ruler can grapple this dysfunction into function. Only a wise ruler can give vision to their blindness. Only Amir, Var Amris, can save the North. So our armies have again crossed the Yarg Yaruga? Okay. For the third and final time. Oh boy. <sighs> well, I guess we figured out why everything's so angry in life. I mean, I would be too, hating for life. That's an important thing. Humming. Place of power. It's gotta be. Hold to draw power. My thing is vibrating, Wink Wonk. Gained one ability point. Gwen. Sign intensity increase. I do like Gwen. Gwen? Quen. I, I mean, fuck me. Alright. <laughs> I can't English. Don't don't question anything. Wolfsbane. Deer, wolves. I could use some more wolf meat. Oh. Damn, you're ugly. Motherfucker, is that the only insult you got, girl? Come on. Damn, you're ugly. I think they know. I'm I'm good at the dodging. Yeah. Uh oh. Big pupper. That poor thing. Oh, you're not dead from that. Fuck. Huh. Feel my dodgies. Oh, God. Fuck out of here. Raw meat. Killed that poor deer in the act, too. Oh, well. I'm sure it'll be useful. Yeah, at least I would expect as much. Lots of, uh... Dead animals here. They were hunting. I guess I'll take some of the spoils. I mean, there's no reason not to, right? Yeah, maybe there is. Huh. You mother... Fucking... Damn it. Little crit. All right, come on, big boy. Man, they're fast. And wolves are huge, too. Honestly, I should be more scared of wolves. Wolves are a terrifying thing. Huge. Insanely strong. Just all around scary. Apex predators, if you will. Uh, anyway. Roach! Let's not run all that way. I gotta use you, man. It's important to use my horsey. We have a bond. Unshakable. 
Except for when you throw me to the wolves, literally. Like you did earlier. That was fun. Don't do that again, please. Not interested in these things. Just want some buckthorn. That's all. Simple, really. Ooh. No drowners, I hope. Not my cup of tea, really. What? What's going on your here? Key, man? No, not me key. Me pan. Your... It's always sat what? there empty. This hurt. That is. Till the night afore the battle. A man arrived. Walked right in like for his own. Stand at the window. Peering at the goings on. He must have heard me. Cause next I knew, there he was, coming my way. So. I grabbed me pan for protection, see? But he just asks all polite, Gran, got any birch bark by chance? Lilac berries or even a few coals? Nay, says I. And you must be right daft to pester folk at night with such foolery. But I see he ain't listening. Just staring at me pan like a magpie at a copper. Uh huh. Lend it to me, Gran. I'll give it back, come on. He's really baffled for what's he doing, frying in the dark. But I've got a soft heart, so I gave it to him. Right, okay. Interesting. What happened then? Before dawn, another rode up to the hut. But come on, only the first fella left. Locked the door, hopped on his horse. And that were all I saw of him, and me pan. Twere old, black with sort, not worth much, I suppose. But I've no other. Will you help me, dearie? Bring an old widow or pan. I could never break down that door myself. And in truth, I'm a fear to go in any road. Such a stench wafting out. Me thinks the other fellow. Well. But he's lying there. You're probably not wrong. All right, whatever. Never taken on a pan contract. Fine, I'll go in. Look <laughs> around. You should wait here. Just Never taken case. on a pan contract. Uh, I'm assuming Arden would be what I'm looking for. Oh yeah. I'm breaking down that door. I mean, I'm just going to take all the loot in here, if you don't mind. Rotting flesh? That's lovely. I don't know why the hell that's like that. Here, I'll light some of your candles. It's a little dark in here. And I'll loot this through the wall. A corpse explains the stench. Mm-hmm. His throat. He was garroted. And some old scars. Kind of soldier might have. Love his throat. That, he was garroted. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> and some old scars. Cracked monocle. Kind of soldier might Just have. Him. Found the pan, have you? Shush. I was making lots of um duplicated dialogues. Well, oh, there's the frying pan. Documents. Almost entirely burnt. A few pieces still legible. Found the pan, have you? Lady, and when you arrange to meet, you fucking show up. I did, risking my life in the entire blasted operation, and then up standing there with my plowing cock in my hands, waiting for nothing. Alright. I thought the Nilfgaardian army was better organized than that, but you... Tell that blessed Lord General of yours that me and my companions didn't or don't hold grudges, so we won't break off negotiations. But since our old plan's gone tits up, this time we'll choose. Yeah, we'll choose the time and place for the next meeting. Right. Okay. Ah, uh, the priceless frying pan. Hmm. Scrubbed clean. Hmm. Looks like the mystery man didn't need the pan so much as the soot off it. To make ink, write letters. Found the pan, 
Oh my fucking lord, lady. <laughs> Okay, so much about your stupid fucking frying pan. Give me a goddamn moment. I'm looking for loot. All right, calm your shit. There. Here, your frying pan. Mine? But mine were black with soot, and I could see myself in this one if I wanted. But them years are past. It was the soot the man needed. He scraped it off to make ink. Must have had an urgent letter to write. Urgently burned some other documents too. And. and the other fellow? Dead. Round up a few boys and bury him outside the village. Deep, so the necrophages don't dig him up. And take my advice. Don't mention this to the Nilf Guardians. Hang about! You've earned a token of thanks. Here, son. For the road. Thanks, lady. Hmm. Fish. I like fish. Experience points. Baked apple. Some bread. I like food. Apple juice. Fuck yeah, apple juice. Alright, I'm gonna get some fucking... Oh yeah, that's nice. Oh boy. Holy shit, there's a lot of them down there. Oh my. Okay. Well. Not really my cup of tea, but you know. Well, I'm gonna have a bad fucking time. <laughs> We're gonna save. Because I don't, uh. Me don't trust shit. Alright, get in the fuck out of here. I'm not really interested in getting murdered by lots of, uh. Should talk to visitors. Lots of death. Oh, I have to go back that way. Well, poo. I don't want to go back that way. I have to turn all the way around. God damn it. I'm assuming those are fucking drowners. I wouldn't think they're anything else, honestly. Wouldn't make much sense to me. But I suppose everything's up for debate in this game. Talk to Vesemir. Ah, yes, we're gonna go hunt the griffin together. Mm-hmm. Yes. Do I have any side quests that I can Come do? On. Doesn't seem like it. I'm assuming there are other quests I could take, though, like this, whatever that is. Um, he wants to go there. Uh, anything else? There's still a lot of stuff that I could explore. But who knows? I'll think about it as time passes. As I said, I am one to explore. But I also like doing main quests, too. So we will see. We will see indeed. Ah, yes, it's that way. Right, I'm following the wrong one. Curses. For my... inept fascination with dots. <laughs> Goodness. Ah, oh, thanks, Roach. What do we got over here? Ah, yes, the blacksmith. Someone's angry. What happened here? Oh, got a wee bit chilly the night, so I set fire to my forge. Got it nice and roaring. Roasted some wieners. <laughs> what do you think happened, dimwit? Some bugger set a light me, me workshop. I've lost everything. Everything! I'm sorry. Sorry. Any suspects? Whole damned village. I've lived here half a century. Thought they saw me as one of their own. But everything changed when the Black Ones came. I'm the only smith around, so I got to service their garrison. Bang dents out of plate, shoe horses. That sort of thing. Nilf Guardians don't pay me a bloody copper. Just give me supplies and orders. The humans can't fathom that. They think I'm getting rich off their misfortune. That I sleep on a pile of gold like a plowing dragon. They've stopped talking to me. Spit when I pass. And now this. <laughs> Good luck rebuilding. Farewell. I can find your arsonist for a price. I can find your arsonist, provided you're willing to pay. <sighs> a 
I've not much left, but I'll give you all if you bring me that horse in, so that he gets what he deserves. The night of the fire, I heard movement outside my hut. Went out to see if I could find any tracks. I found nothing. But then I haven't got cat eyes, have I? True. Good luck. Don't worry, buddy. I'll look for him. Alrighty, let's go, uh... Look for these, these footprints, huh? Shall we? Also look at uh, these things. Ah. Shavings from a tinderbox. Arsonist must have lit his torch here, tossed it on the roof, then fled through the orchard. Mm hmm. Boot prints. A man's. Large. Seems a little wobbly. Stinks of piss and vodka. Uh, there you go. Drunk, too. Gotta love it. Arsonists, man. Okay. Where the hell are you going, friend? Why would you go over here? Get rid of your tracks? Is that what you're trying to do? Uh huh. Took off his boots and went in the water. Probably wanted to cover his trail. Water's mighty dangerous, friend. Don't tell me he came right up over here. That'd be fucking dumb. Right up over here. Didn't go too far, did you? Blood. Oh, lovely. Now that I suspect Lost in life. Boots in the rush. Yeah, there's also some blood over there. Something jumped out of the rushes. Drowners. But he managed to escape. So I'm looking for someone with a drowner bite. Oh. Hi, what's up? Ah, fucking bitch slap, I suppose, huh? Fuckers. Thanks for the help, friends. Yeah, I'll take the loot. You just give them the what for. Go on. Don't let them get away. I'm not gonna get involved. I don't wanna... I don't want any part of this. Last time I did that... Fucking... <laughs> they got angry at me because I accidentally hit them with one of my abilities and they kicked my ass. That's something I'm interested in in life. Fuck you on about? What else does it want me to look for down here? Those? I already examined those. Took off his boots and went in the water. Yeah, I got that. Wanted to cover his trail. Is this bleeding, but not badly? Surface wound. Uh. Okay. Is it following true? blood or? Man, you and your bathing once every three moons, friend. Ah. Tracks lead back to the village. Fair enough. Hey, isn't that uh? We meet again. Thank you for saving me. Name. People Bram. say all kinds of things about witches, but I've always known yours to be an honorable guild. Right. So you managed to salvage some goods. Yes, but I await the repair of my wagon. As time passes, my losses grow. Do you need something? I'll let it go half free. Hmm. What do you got? Let me have a look at your stock. Hmm. Okay. 
bunch of junk. Dwarven spirit. Still pretty expensive. Torn out griffin. Taking damage raises damage resistance. Hmm. For the remainder of the fight. Fascinating. Um. Hmm. I'll take. So expensive, man. I'm not gonna worry about it right now. Sorry, buddy. Take care. Don't just fucking like slide backwards, you fucking weirdo. <laughs> God, I was expecting enough. Whatever, man. Good man. Whose field is that the other side of the river? By the wood. Boy in Climax. Good lad, Master Witcher. Though he. Yes, yes. This boy in. Will he venture out to inspect his grain anytime soon? What for? Harvest is a long way off yet. Mm hmm. So I heard something about a witcher. Ah. Trail ends here, but I'll recognize him by his wounds. Twisted fire starters. Don't let us talk to strangers. Well, you're talking to a stranger, friend. Ah, oh, hello there. Nap. Claw marks. It's gotta be him. Nasty wound. Run into a drowner. What the fuck do you care? Whoa. Our arsonist's a charmer, too. Come on. Smith wants to talk Still to you. Still drunk, too. Why not talk to a non-human? Sons of bitches all. And dwarves are the worst. Greedy little magpies. Do anything for gold, they will. <laughs> they forge the blades the black ones put to our throats. Am I not right? Okay. Listen, we can work this out man to man. I give you gold. You don't turn me in. My mum died a while back and I sold her tools. I've spent some, but what's left is yours. Oh, you're a lovely person. No. Magpies and dwarves might be greedy, but I'm not. Can't buy me. Then I'll beat your fucking mug to a pulp. Uh. Calm down. Now follow me. Not interested. God. Good lord. Nah, huh? Nah, huh? Whatever, man. Apologize. Gotta go. Apologize. Man, I'm taking all your shit. least you can do for me. Yeah, go on and apologize, fucker. Good lord. What are you doing? Come on. Get your ass in gear. It's just a goose. Get your fucking ass over here. Come on, I'll beat the shit out of you and carry you. Let's go. Man, you wobbling son of a bitch. All right, fine. You do that. I'm gonna go check out this board. There's nothing on it. God damn it. Well, maybe I can just go talk to him. There. Up and at him. Hmm? What? What? What's going on? Here you go. One village pyromaniac in the flesh. Now, you. I knew your mum for years. Charged her nary a copper. This is how you repay me. I've had enough. Hey, soldier. A minute of your time, please. No, Willis, I beg you. I, 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 I was drunk. Didn't know what I was doing. I've told you, Master Willis. We will help you rebuild once reinforcements come. The supplies have been ordered. Not what this is about, mate. This here's the arsonist. A witcher found him. The forge was important to the garrison. Destroying it was sabotage. No trial needed here. Just a tree. Oh boy.
villagers will really love you now. Well, no, I don't give a flying fuck about them. Damn. You know, I hated the black ones at first, like everybody else did. Now I'm thinking they might just bring order to this place. Teach these layabouts some manners. But enough about that. Your reward. And Thanks, buddy. I managed to save some things from the fire. Anvil still holds, so I'm sure I can bang something out on it. You need anything, let me know. Give you a good price. Sounds good, man. I'm gonna use your, uh... Use your that. <laughs> First, because I'd like to sharpen my weapon, make it nice. You know. Got some crowns. Got some other stuff. We're doing okay. We're gonna go talk to Vesemir. Hey, buddy. Yes? What is it, Wolf? Oh, you know, the usual. Got a contract. Got good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bads that we have to kill the griffin for mm. him. What else could he want from two witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Got the buckthorn already? Got the buckthorn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. Mm. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss, standard smells of the countryside. Remember Tredegor, hunting that Zugal in the trash heap? You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> Got some information. Things. It's a male, had its nest in the Vulpine Woods. The Nilf Guardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. <laughs> it's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. Time to set the trap. I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already. Other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Sounds good, good man. Me there. Alrighty. I'm gonna end this session off here, though, methinks. I'm pretty tired. I don't know. I can't keep my... I can't keep myself energized, so... I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait... You know, get energized, continue this shit tomorrow, feel better, get really into this shit instead of being super, uh, not into it, you know? You feel me? So yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Or, well, you know, whenever you guys see this. Peace out!